I want to ring the bell. I want to ring the bell. Richard! Yay. My name is Mother Goose, and I'm definitely shaking loose. I've been eating too many buffalo burgers. How about you folks? Do you like a buffalo burger now and then? So do I. I get up every morning. Oh, by the way, I've been in the United States of America for about 200 years. Now, I'm just teasing you when I tell you this, but some of you look like you've been around for a couple of hundred years, too. What is your secret for looking so handsome and so young? Do you do what I do every morning? I get up at 3 a.m. and I go out and I plow the lower 40. And then I go milk my 82 cows. And then I feed my 32 piggies. Oh my goodness. And then I go to the kitchen. And I say to myself, I need a bowl of porridge. And I go to the stove and I get myself a bowl of porridge. And I say to myself, peas porridge hot. Peas porridge cold. Peas porridge in the pot nine days old. Now don't eat it eight days old. It's so delicious on the ninth day. <laughs> oh, hello Elizabeth. Do you see Elizabeth out there anywhere? Oh, Elizabeth, hello. It's rather cloudy today. I don't see very many of them. Oh, there they go. Hello Elizabeth. Are you waving to Elizabeth? Do you see her out there? I have 312 geese. I named them all the same name. What do you suppose I call them? Yes, ma'am. Could it be? No, no, no. You're very close. How about Elizabeth? Oh, my goodness. Yes, Elizabeth. Now, I'm going to tell you a story. But you see, all of my things are way over there. And you are where? Way over here. So, do you mind coming a little closer? Because this is a very interactive program. And you get to dress up and you get to become the characters. It's for all ages. So come on, come on, come on down here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, this is oh, my daughter would love this. I'm just a little kid. Aren't we? I will have you dress up in a heartbeat. <laughs> and Richard. <laughs> this is called Ask for Mind. The fish show, oh, get the drag off. <laughs> That's the other show we get. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is G. The farther down you get, it goes PG, PG 13, R, the next. I've been telling for years and years and years. And I'm going to need some assistance from the audience. So are you going to be willing to help me tell my story? Okay, first of all, I'm going to need someone to There's play the part of a grown up, mature lady. Is there a grown up, mature lady somewhere in the audience? Oh, oh, this lady right here. Hi, pick me, yeah, pick right me. Oh, right over here. Oh, come on. Jeff's oh, a mature yeah. lady. Yeah. Now, oh, no, I volunteer. When you tell a story, you always ask permission before you put a costume on them or give them something. So may I put a costume <laughs> on you? <laughs> oh, Yay. Yay. First of all, I'll give her a little dog. Is that all right with you? Okay. It's rather pitiful. Yes, it is. Now, I'm going to give her... Oh, do you know what this is? Very good. Some of you younger housewives don't know this is in the top ten of household cleaning items. And the men are going, oh, yeah, it certainly is. I have a mop. Now, I'm going to put an apron on this lovely lady. Now, I think you brush your teeth with it. burgers have you been eating this week? How many buffalo burgers have you been eating this week? You know what? I'm going to go over my Well, maybe she's very honest because if this apron does not go around her, oh. then that means that she was not telling me the truth, ladies and gentlemen. But look at this. This is just too good. This is incredible. It's a perfect fit. It's like I've gone out and purchased this just for you. Do you think she should wear this? Oh, yes. Oh, no. oh, that was even better. We like that one. Yay. Now, this is called a mop hat. Why they didn't call it a mop hat, I will never know. But anyhow, at one size fits all, and everybody always gets to wear this one hat. Oh, well, oh, excuse me. I liked it the other way. <laughs>
she gets up every morning at 3 a.m. and you go out to the lower floor and get some baby oh, in the house. Now, I need, uh, would you come over here and be my banner, girl? Yeah, you stand over here and I'll hand the banners to you. But you help me there. Now, did anyone bring an instrument with them that we could play today? Did anyone bring their guitar or no? What do you think this is? Do you think this is a guitar? Very good, it's not. What did I hear you say? A ukulele. Can we all say the word ukulele together? A ukulele. Now let's see if I get a sound out of it. You've done that before. Ukulele. Now, usually I sit down to play this, so let me see here. Okay. Now, am I getting close? I think I'm getting close. Do you have good insurance at the fair? I need to know that. I miss that. She put, On she the count of three, say, shake it loose, no, Mother this Goose. Mother Goose. One, One, two, three. Shake it loose, Mother Goose. Oh, that's very nice. I like this. And she's actually pretty good Kentucky. Don't you wish you could just ride around the country and play instruments all day and tell stories and have a good time? Now, do you know the story about old Mother Hubbard? Oh, by the way, I need another character. If you've got a way to get onto your Facebook or everywhere else, make sure to update it. This is still going on. I've been doing everything in my power. I called all the radios. This gentleman, are you going to take the whole thing? Are you going Very good. Yay! If I don't, she'll kill me. Now, I have a costume for you, sir. You will be known as the Tall Dark Stranger. Yes. Oh, dear. <laughs> now, I'm going to give you a choice. Let's see. Mm -hmm. This hat. Sure, I know. What do you think? This hat? Oh, they said yes. Don't you think he looked better with more hair in it? Yay! <laughs> All right. You can leave your hat on, sir. Oh, and, oh, he's very tall. Oh, look. It's a battle. <laughs> Joe. Now, sir, you will be known as the Tall Dark Stranger. So you go over there, and when I call for the Tall Dark Stranger, you just come around it. <laughs> oh, I'm out of my seat. Hey, shake it loose, mother. Hold on, dude. I guess I gotta go over there. Okay. 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 Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? That's the, uh, By the way, you're called the banner girl. Zoom. Okay. 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 Oh, you don't have so I'll just keep hand. it over the side of that. If you want to take a picture while it's video, just... Oh, this is what? Okay. 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 Oh, this is Children, how many? 
she gave them some broth and she gave them some bread and then she gave them a spanking. <gasps> No, we don't give spankings anymore. We give them time out. <laughs> <laughs> and then she put them to bed. And every night she would tell them a story. You're going to love to this story. Down. Oh, my goodness. Get ready for this story, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it was a cold and winter night. And it was raining outside. You could hear it on the top of the shoe coming down. And it was pitter patter, pitter patter. And old Mother Harper said, Now, children, I'm going to tell you a story I've been telling for years and years. I'm going to tell you all about my boyfriend. Do you know who my boyfriend is? Humpty Dumpty! <laughs> I love Humpty Dumpty. He's my man. And he's going to help take care of all 76 children. Oh, except. He just gave me a message here. Oh no! Humpty Dumpty has run away to America. He's gotten in a big boat. Oh no! And he's rolled. There he goes. Do you see him rolling off in the distance? Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the stream. Merry, 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 merry. Life is but a dream. There goes my Humpty Dumpty. Now what am I going to do with some of his six children? At about that time, she looked out the window. And she saw a tall, dark stranger coming down a long, winding road. And he got closer and closer and closer. And he came to the door. And he knocked on the door. Oh, very good. <laughs> and, and old Mother Hubbard went to the door. And she said, oh, my goodness, you're the most handsome man I've ever seen in my life. Where did you come from? And he said, well, ma'am, I have a problem. Can you say, well, ma'am, I have a problem? <laughs> Well, man. Maybe not. I gotta get glasses dirty if we're doing those. Well, man, I got a problem. I cannot breathe. I cannot breathe. Oh, no. Here's a grown up, intelligent, handsome, well, fairly handsome man. And he cannot breathe. Oh, dear. I can't hear you. The children. <laughs> oh, my goodness. We all know how to read because we listen to the stories of old mother. You just come on in, sir, and have a seat with us, and we're going to teach you how to read. And old Mother Hubbard's heart was going pitter-patter, pitter-patter. <laughs> <laughs> and she said, now, children, let me tell you, we're going to get in a great big boat tomorrow, and we're going to go after Humpty Dumpty. Are you ready? And so that's just what they did. They all got in a great big boat, and they started singing. Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the street. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. And she said, land ho! Oh! And she looked out from the, the canoe that had all 76 children, and she saw <laughs> land ho! And there was, get ready, banner girl, get the pink one. She got all the children out of the boat, and she ran up the hill to this farmhouse, and in this farmhouse was the cutest little boy and girl. I need a young man to come up here, and I need a young lady to come up here. They were in the farmhouse, and they were dancing the waltz. Everybody put your hands together and give them a little bit of music here. So let's see some moves here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They were known as the Baker Children. And they were baking something. Oh, yeah. You are very good. Yes, here we go. There was a tall, dark stranger here. And they were dancing around. Look at the banner. Look what they were doing. Back and forth. Back and forth. And they were singing something like, Patty cake, baker's man. Make me a cake as fast as you can. Roll it and pat it with the bee. For baby and me. Oh, can't you just smell that cake in the oven? Come here, old Mother Hubbard. She said, my goodness, we're going to have food for my children. Look at that cake in the oven. And she pulled it out of the oven. And she said, oh, children, look at this lovely cake. Now, what you don't know about old Mother Hubbard is... <laughs> <laughs> she dropped the cake off. <laughs> and the little baby children said, oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. It only took us six hours to make the cake. <laughs> and there it is. You know what they did? 
they went over to Old Mother Hubbard and gave her a big hug and said, we forgive you, Old Mother Hubbard. Oh, this have Oh, and they looked at each other and they said, we don't know who she is. So let's get out of here as fast as possible. So they ran off as fast as they could. I said, oh, did that hurt? Oh, did it? Give them a big round of applause. Uh, sir, 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 oh, oh, sir, 
I don't know who she is, so. But you can have her. You can have her. And you ran off as fast as you could. Good thing. I'm going to cry to the party. And about that time, the whole mother, I'm just playing my boy. But she saw the cutest little girl. Oh, she was ever so cute. She was sitting under a tree. <laughs> Did you lose it? You lost it right here. I knew I left it there. I left it here. We're naked. We're naked. Put on this trumpet. No. Put on this trumpet. No. Put on this trumpet. Yes. Yes. Now, what you don't know about Little Miss Muffy is she's the big screen of the So on the count of three. This show have us. One, two, three. Because she'll go for half an hour, then Joe will go for half an hour, then Troy will go for half an hour. Yeah. That's his column of boot. So he'll make super balls for the line, so everybody. So if anybody comes up, that's what it'll do. Now, can anyone bring a spider with them? Is there a spider in the house? Hey, Scottish guy, don't you hear what he's talking Oh, behind you, you all dark strangers. Oh! If you know who that is, Joe. This looks like it's a bit of Oh, it is! It's a bit of a spider when I looked the water out. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And it's a bit of spider when I looked the spider again. Oh, he loves to do more than just walking down that spout. He loves to take it when he's like it. <laughs> it's a low budget show, ladies and gentlemen. I need a Spider Man. Or Sp oh, would you be Spider Man? Yay! Oh, yeah, Yay! Give him the spider because he can go any. Oh, you can go anywhere you want in the big out here. When he chases you, are you ready for this? Oh, okay. Does everyone know the story about little Miss Muffin? You said on her tongue, you're going to be here, Curtis.
And about that time, he said, on his knee, on his knee, <laughs> on his knee, on his knee. <laughs>
I'm sorry. That's the problem. Never give up. I know there's lots of wonderful things going on out here. It's okay. I'm thinking that it's Troy in the house. It's Troy the juggler next. Nitro. Oh, there's a mad scientist. Are you a mad scientist, sir? Mad scientist. Mad scientist. So let's go over and listen to the Mad Scientist. Nitro Joe, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah.